you might be wondering why I'm pushing the frame of a Land Rover around the streets of Coburg. Well, I thought this would be the easier option. It's the cheaper option. It's the less polluting option than putting it on a trailer just to drive a block and a half. Plus, we needed to build a trolley <clears throat> to work on these chassis. And because we've got a pipeline, quite a few to build now, it's worth, you know, making some, making some other tools to help with the work. So one of those things is a trolley to hold these chassis. taking it around to the sandblaster along with a whole bunch of other parts to get them just pristine. We could spend a long time with a, with a grinder or a wire wheel, um, you know, pressure washing, paint stripping, all of those kinds of things. But these guys at the blast factory, they love blasting. They've got all the tools, all the things they can blast with plastic. Um, which means that it won't affect the surface of the metal at all. It'll just remove anything on the surface. Uh, so it means we can put even more delicate parts in there that otherwise you wouldn't want to put through sandblasting. So it doesn't smooth out the texture at all. It leaves exactly the texture of the metal. It just perfectly cleans it. So, Clive in at Space Tank helped weld this. I did want to weld it myself, but we just ran out of time and you would have got to see my terrible welding and why uh, I will never be doing a weld on one of our finished vehicles. But Clive did an amazing weld job in 45 minutes and put this trolley together for us. So I'm kind of going some back roads. It's a bit further than I otherwise would have liked. But it is kind of fun. smashed into a taxi. <laughs> it's really neat, this is a two-person job. It's 100%, a two to three person job.
this has been really successful. This is a great trolley. I'm super glad we made it.